Good morning guys from Latitude Festival. So I am here with Carlsberg this year and I am literally so excited. Like I am such a festival girl. I love festivals. I love spending time just like having fun, listening to music and just everything they're about. Like British festivals are literally like nothing in the world. Like they are so much fun. So it's actually the second day that we're here. So we got here kind of late last night, had a little mooch around and then slept and now it is the next morning. So me and Laura have just gone and done all of our face gems and stuff. I got my hair done yesterday. So I've got this little like, Ariana style affair. Um, I'm wearing a little white dress today with some little cycle shorts underneath and then I've got my cowboy boots. I'll show you a proper outfit in a minute and then like these little face gems from In Your Dreams which I absolutely love. They're one of my favourite gem brands because they do the really like, nice delicate ones and not like the big like face pieces. But um, yeah, very excited. I'm gonna go head round and find some breakfast and stuff in a minute because it's only nine in the morning. Um, so obviously we need to like get some food get some coffee in etc but i'm very excited i literally just love festivals like they are so much fun and i can't wait to explore a little bit so this is the kind of campsite situ so this is what you stay in these little like tents and then this is the little tent here so it's actually quite roomy inside you've got a little bed situ um but it's a really cool little area so laura and i just bought <laughs> a sheep <laughs> Thank you. Um, we just bought some pink fluffy sheep because Latitude is famous for its pink sheep and <laughs> we decided one is called Latty and one is called Chewed. Which, <laughs> which one's which? Which one's which? Which one do you Yours want? Yours is Latty, I'll be Chewed. Okay, Latty and Chewed. <laughs> <laughs> We're like You're children. So it's 10am. We haven't had a drink yet, I promise. <laughs> They're really cute. I love them. They're actually really soft as well. I know. Love it. covered in grass. I'm definitely cuddling it in bed tonight when I've had a few drinks. <laughs> <laughs> Sam will come in and we'll be like, <laughs> <laughs> but um, we it. just shot a few pics. You're definitely not gonna be able to hear me, so I'll talk in a minute. Got my little headscarf on, really cute. <laughs> Tell me about your bargy. <laughs> well, I've got it down my top, so I'm now wearing my bargy. That's a crispy top. So good though, isn't it? I've been able to get frizz on it. Really We've been sat here for a long time and we're all full. Yeah. Sam, demolishing his. So good. So <laughs> Literally the biggest bargy bowl ever. Like I have been demolishing this for so long and it's still full. It's only five bucks, so, so good. Sam spotted someone with it yesterday. Basically we have to hunt it down, but it's so good. I look like a giant floating head, but very much enjoying. So I've got my little raincoat on because it's starting to spit a little bit earlier and it's meant to rain today. Whether it does or not is a very different story, but it's supposed to. So the raincoat is like in prep, but we're just heading around to the like Danish quarter bit, which is where Carlsberg basically pitches up, which is just over there. And it's basically just like a little pop-up bar. They have live acts and stuff, uh, live music. It's really, really good, really cool place to be. And they also serve a lot of Carlsberg. So we're gonna head over there and maybe get a couple of drinks. Sam needs to get a couple of pictures. And Laura's just over here having a good time taking some selfies. <laughs> So we went to see George Ezra and basically had the time of our lives. I'm with Laura. Hello. The hangovers are real today. Um, but we are about to head back into the festival and 
<laughs> you just look like a little head poking round. <laughs> um, but we're about to head back into the festival and go and find some food and some water and probably some Carlsberg and yeah. what else did you want to do? Yum bun. Yum bun. Yum, yum bun. bun. If you live in London and haven't tried yum bun, you really need to. It's like the best thing so ever. Good. Like it's so good. Um, but George Ezra was amazing, wasn't he? He was loved so it. Good. So good. I feel like he sounds just as good live as like normally. Yeah, he literally sounds yeah. the same. I think. Yeah. He's really good. Also, how cute is Laura's gems? We bought Indie these ones at the festival. They're very yeah. cute. Yours are really nice and like delicate. I really like them. Thanks. Oh, that's fun. These ones are odd, but <laughs> you can't notice, can you? I mean, I didn't actually notice. <laughs> yeah, no, these, these ones are definitely odd. That's fine. We'll overlook that. It looks nicer. We'll I like it. There. Thank you. I feel like you could also stick them in so many different ways on your head. Yeah, and I've got like you could put them on more in my bag as well. So, can we oh, do a bag, of bag of wonders. Bag of wonders. Bag of wonders. But, uh, bag of vibes. <laughs> <laughs> Literally bum bag vibes. Bum bag vibes. The only time I've wear a bum bag. Oh, overview of my outfit. These are from um, In Your Dreams, Ray Bands. This is Misguided. This is from Nasty Gal. It's like a tassel thing. These shorts are and other stories. This is from Topshop. These are from Nasty Gal. Laura? <laughs> Whoa, that's very close on Big my head, face. It's getting closer. <laughs> so we're just currently in the woods, which is like a different part of the festival. Like this is probably one of the most like crazy amount of things you can possibly do in one festival, in a festival. So there's like poetry bits, there's comedy stages, it's like literally all sorts. And we are in the woods where there's loads of little bits to do. And there's loads of like cool artwork everywhere, like here. Um, you can watch people doing art. There's like really like cool like techno and like house acts and stuff in the evening. There's swimming, like there's literally loads of stuff. Um, so we're just quickly doing some bits now. Sam's just shooting with Laura over there. Then we're gonna head back to the Danish quarter, which is Carlsberg little area. And basically that's where you can get all the Carlsberg beer and like summer's be cider and that kind of thing. So we're gonna head back over there because the new Pilsner is so good. Like the Danish Pilsner is so good. Like it's literally made me a convert. I am now obsessed. I love that beer so much. It's all I've drunk all weekend. It's just started raining, so the ponchos have come out. <laughs> You can literally heavy, like, see really everyone is. from over there just like slowly putting their coats on the rain starting like to come. Yeah. <laughs> I like yours though, I think yours is cool because you can just chuck it on. Um, yes, but yeah, we literally, on. everyone just started chucking their coats on and running because obviously it was like the quick panic to just get your coats and stuff on before you get absolutely smothered by the rain. Because hear it before this you is my see first. It, it's like thundering. Yeah. <laughs> it literally is like watching acid rain, like you said. Everyone's like, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it is so bad. Bloody hell. Let's find shelter here. So we're going to sit for a minute. Sam needs to get a few picks and we're just going to try and avoid avoid the rain. So we are now at the Danish quarter just having a quick drink before we head out and see Stereophonics later. I'm very excited to see them actually. I saw them last year at Rise and they were really, really good. So definitely looking forward to it. But you definitely have to try the new Danish Pilsen from Carlsberg. A little bit of an ad, but it is the best beer ever. Like genuinely, I don't really like beer that much and this has changed my mind completely. Like change the game. I absolutely love it. So just with all the gang and stuff here, all drinking it. And then we're going to head over and watch Stereophonics. Say hi! I've been on two tours in this shot, yeah.
what 10 a.m. I'm not actually sure what the time is, but we're up and ready to go. We're just taking a few pictures for Sam now, and then we're going to head over to get some breakfast and go to the Danish Quarter, which is the Carlsberg like bar area. I would say tent, but it's not a tent. It's actually like a full-on like wooden structure. Um, and Lizzie, one of the girls we're with, is doing a talk there, all about like plastic and eco stuff. So I'm going to try and put some clips of what she says in this because I obviously don't want to do the whole thing. It's going to be like 45 minutes or something, but I'll pick out like key points and stuff, all to do with Carlsberg because I don't know if I've showed you in the vlog yet, but they have like a new snack pack for their Danish Pilsner, and it's basically got these little glue dots that hold it all together, so it's a lot more eco-friendly. And the only thing that you cannot recycle is the little strap over the top, so a lot more eco-friendly than the kind of typical beer packaging where it's got all the plastic rings and the dye is a lot more eco-friendly too so it's a lot like safer for the environment um very very cool but i will leave that to lizzie to explain when she does her talk because she obviously knows a lot more about it and a lot more like in depth and stuff but very very cool that it's very eco-friendly and it's a lot better to kind of carry around and stuff like i find it so much nicer to just like snap one off than like have to get it out and stuff i'll show you in a minute because we'll probably grab one on the way to get breakfast <laughs> early morning drinking drink responsibly I've got these Gypsy Shrine gems, which did have like little under eye ones, but they sweated off yesterday. I've just got my hair natural, a swimsuit on, I've got this bum bag, which is from ASOS, and this big shaggy jacket, which is from Nasty Gal, and just like shorts and boots, as always. Um, jacket, great idea because it looks cool. Not a great idea because I'm absolutely boiling already, and it's only like 9 a.m. I think it's like 24 degrees, which is crazy, but definitely not complaining when it was raining all day yesterday. These two get in the gram shots. Literally all I've eaten all weekend is Yonban and cans of Carlberg. This is all I've consumed. <laughs> if you've never been before, Yonban is the best thing ever. It's a London place. Oh, it's very close to my face now. <laughs> zooming in. It is literally like the most delicious thing ever. It's in London in a lot of places, so definitely recommend going and trying it out. It's also a lot of festivals, so go. have you gone for? This is the paella. It's the paella from Paelleria. Looks it's so chicken good. chicken chorizo and veg, but so Chicken good. chorizo and veg? Ooh. Chicken chorizo and veg. They do a chicken chorizo and a veg, but this is both. Yum. Yeah. I'm so excited to eat it. <laughs> Food coma. So good. Try some. Little, little smidge. I don't need to try your buns on thingy. Oh my god, that is so like, not saucy, but so like flavorful. Mm. So good. So yeah. I bet all of this is amazing as well. Sam, what food did you get? I had a barbecue whiskey burger, bourbon burger, bacon, pulled pork, fries, and then deep fried whiskey mac and cheese pans. How were they? <laughs> we've literally eaten such good food since we've been here. Like everything has just been so, so yummy. Um, but now we're going to go and get a little drink and then we're going to head over to the comedy tent for the afternoon and just sit there and have a little laugh. Like your girl 